Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So it's your girl and Seti. For today's video, I should share with you the one of probably the most experience in the online class. Eh, yung nag-experiment kami. So, papakita ko lang kung anong ginawa namin doon. And, dito, nagamit ko na yung mga pinamili namin sa bamba. Tulad ng alcohol lamp, yung Benedict Solution. I said, dito yung mga test tube and all that. So, if you are interested kung anong ginawa namin dito, stay tuned. So, itong nag-experiment namin is, it helps identify kung may sugar kaba or protein or albumin sa iyong kahit lang naman kailangan di ba um, 10 ml so, we start na experiment namin kasi hindi ako na eh. Alam niyo pag sinasabing nakakaihi daw. So, yan yung iniisip ko that time para maihi. Eh, na para konti lang naman ang mga-consume niya pag nag-heat kayo. Ikaw mo naman kami, Miss A. Ikaw mo naman kami, Miss A. Ikaw mo so onti pala nang nilagay ko tapos hindi pa nababasa ng denatured yung taas. So, pag di nabasa, eh, di hindi siya aapoy. So, hirap na hirap ako, sis. Ang tagal ko talaga dito. So, ayan, inaamoy-amoy ko siya kasi inaantay ko para maapoyan ko na siya. Yes, amoy denatured na. Feeling ko sasabog na tayo mamaya. Joke. So, ito yung Benedict Solution. Ito yung unang reagent na gagamitin natin para ito doon sa sugar sa urine. So, magbo-voice over na lang ako dahil hindi ako nakapag-off ng mic ko dito. And, ang gagawin natin is, kuha tayong test tube, tapos punuin natin ng Benedict's 3 fourths. Sabi ng aming pro. Uh, walang change, Okay. So, yung Benedict's na kinuha natin kanina, papakuluan natin siya. Moments later. So, yung angle ng test tube, dapat medyo nakaslant siya. Tapos, alis-alisin yung minsan sa fire kasi kumukulo talaga siya. Mararamdaman mo siya. Para siyang puputok. Ang gano'ng katagal puto? Para kasi siyang sasabog na. Igalaw-galaw mo. Huwag itutok, miss. So after yung kumulo, lalagyan ko na siya ng aking ihe, mga 7 drops. So, ngayon naman ay papakulan ulit natin siya. So, ito yung nagawa na namin before. Sa ibang kaklase ko, nag-iba yung color ng test tube nila. So, pag nag-iba yung kulay from blue to like red, ibig sabihin may, may sugar po yung urine nyo. And, nagbavary yung level ng sugar sa urine nyo. Depende sa color. Tada! So, ito na yung end result natin. So, nag-remain siya na color blue. Ibig sabihin, wala akong sugar sa urine. Now, ito po yung sinasabi kong nag-iiba yung kulay at yung meaning niya. So, this is the second experiment. We're going to fill the test tube halfway through with our own urine.
Remember that the presence of protein in the urine is not normal. It may indicate a problem with your kidneys. So if the test results um, from this experiment comes back as cloudy, then it may indicate protein in the urine. Now if the cloudiness disappears, then it may indicate phosphate. Phosphate is fairly normal as long as the amount is very minimal. So we're just going to bring this to a boil and then we're going to add a few drops of acetic. So as you can see, my test tube is near boiling point at this moment. The bubbles are rising. So after boiling, I set it aside and I took my acetic acid and we're just going to drop a few of these into the test tube. And we're going to boil it again. So here I added 3 to 4 drops of acetic acid. Now I'm boiling it again with the acetic acid. As you can see, it does not become turbid or cloudy. It remains clear all throughout. So, ayun lang, ay yung ginawa namin, mga siguro less than one hour na mga ginawa to. So, itong nag-experiment namin is, it helps identify kung may sugar ka ba, or protein or albumin sa iyong ihe. So, yung naging result naman sa test ko is, wala po. So, I hope may natutunan kayo dito. Just a short and quick video. Gusto ko lang talaga i-share sa inyo kasi medyo interesting siya sa part. Oh, and uh, you guys may find it interesting as well. Good luck and thanks for watching, guys. Bye.